Well, a warm welcome, everybody, to this grand, grand final. It is the final, the winners of which can rightly claim to be the greatest in South America. This year's competition has surely lived up to billing. It has produced more than its fair share of high-quality moments. It is a tournament we have become so used to relishing over the years, and now we are down to its last 90 minutes. As we survey the stands of the Maracanã, what a sight it is, a terrific sight, a wash with colour, as always has been the case. Two teams, Jim Beglin, with one common thought, to have their names on this famous trophy. Yes, Peter, I've been a, a winning finalist and I've been a, a losing finalist and I don't need to tell anyone what I preferred. Winning will help fans remember you for a long, long time, so I sincerely wish both teams well and hope that all the players can give a good account of themselves and, and you've heard it before, may the best team do it. Well, this is it. As with a lot of finals, caution plays a big part in the opening stages, but an early goal can blow all that away, so I hope that we can um, create a, a, an attacking contest here, which, which obviously we want for this showpiece. Chelhanolu hoists it forward, and it's played forward. Questions were asked, but he's given the answers, and it's William. And here's Kane. He's in space and looking for options. Massive leap! They score! It's hardly a surprise, is it? That's what we're here for, a player with this wonderful knack of being able to show up and deliver at important times. Yet, yet another example. Now looking back at that, that's how you play on the counter. Quick and decisive and ruthless with the finish. I thought it was a stunning, stunning breakaway. Corinthians take the lead, landing the first significant blow in what is certainly a significant contest. Well, certainly the big occasion and a very big opening goal to boost everyone's confidence here. In with a header! Oh, just couldn't turn it in. Now, that was a slick move, and there were several options in the box to, uh, to pick out. Teles. Cristiano Ronaldo. Who's ball? Who's going to get there? Bertou tries to get it forward quickly. It's a loose ball. Tevez! Oh, denied brilliantly! Tevez simply didn't do anything wrong. He was thwarted by brilliance. Gill knocks it away.
Great strength to shapes to shoot! And for a moment, time stood still. And he just whacks it away. And it's Chalhanolu. Xiao Cancelo. He's left his man. He's had a go! was so alert to the possibilities there, great stuff. Oh, Peter, you can't teach that. You either have it or you don't. His anticipation is on another level to everyone else's. Superb. Has certainly made things interesting. Yeah, for me, both sides are strong and well matched, and I think you need to be a good player to be out there right now. Not much subtlety, he's launched himself there. Maguire did well to emerge with the ball. That's a contest to keep an eye on. There's a long ball. Boca Juniors have pushed both fullbacks into quite advanced positions here. Yeah, that's that's interesting. So what are they attempting to do? Well, it's it's a bold attempt, in my opinion, to occupy the opposition in a way they're not expecting. Could move up a gear here. João Cancelo. Decent looking ball. Good run, lovely take, but that is where it stopped. Oh, the weight on the ball was just perfect, and if only they could have come up with a finish to match. The referee's awarded a free kick. And that's put paid to a promising move. Gets away from his opponent. Striding forward, facing goal. He's gone for it. And he's found it. Into the lead once more. That really is quite fabulous. All his own doing. Oh, look, it's always great to see a solo effort with a goal. It's the ideal combination of pace and control. This is what we've been waiting for. Maguire. Corinthians are ahead here. It's been a good half for them. Matic goes looking. It's an untidy challenge. Free kick given. is there and he can get that clear Kane now it's Cristiano Ronaldo good idea just poorly executed away from immediate danger William Trippier 
Gets the better of his man. Room for a shot. There too. Forward it goes. Aimed in towards the centre. And out it comes again. Whistle's gone, and we've reached the halfway point of the final. So a really good half of football. Three goals and just one separating them. So we've had the first 45 minutes of the final, Jim. How's it looking for you? Well, it's obvious who's likely to be more content going in at half-time, but I sincerely hope that there's a, a fitting response from the opposition to really engage us on the big occasion. Corinthians head into the half-time break with a narrow lead, two goals to one. And we are already promptly back on the way. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to go, and he didn't go for the back heel. Cristiano Ronaldo! Oh, and things were shaping up very nicely there after the little drop of the shoulder. Now it's Cristiano Ronaldo. Keeper sends it forward. Flag raised for offside. There too. Shaw. Sure. He came in hard, very hard. Malcolm. Gill. And here's Cristiano Ronaldo. Ball's loose, who's getting there? Alex Tellez. Cristiano Ronaldo. Up to meet it! Oh, real danger here. He's had a shot. Look, there are some very good headers of a ball in this team now, and they'll be demanding the right delivery to give them a chance to, uh, to go at this. And it's Shaw. No question, that's a foul. And he is going into that little black book. That's what has to be done now, no question about it. Jim, there's not too much subtlety or sophistication about this. It really is a question of meat. Oh, it's taken out, that'll be a foul. The referee's come over, it's a red card. Boca Juniors are down to ten men. Played him through. Shot at goal! Oh, that is an awful miss. It was more possible than probable, and the outcome backed it up, Peter. Time for changes on both sides, actually. Xiao Cancelo, this is promising. 
referee's given a throw. There's the delivery. Cleared without complication. He's found his man. Tries a shot! He's pulled off a fine save. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes work ultra sharp. Kick Cade with a shot! Last ditch defending, but that'll do. And here's... Oh, shooting chance! He's done very well to get to that. Well, that was high-class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high-class wage. Oh, that is asking for trouble. He ran himself into trouble there, free kick given away. Oh, no messing about, it is red. Well, they are now a nine-man team. Saul. It's William! And that would have won it. Oh, and a real chance to pile on the pressure, and he would be desperate to get another. Romagnoli pushes to get on the end of it. Boca Juniors are actually displaying tremendous fighting spirit. There's a real belief that they can still have a say. That's pretty clear, it is a foul. And he's going to have his name taken. Protest continues, but in the end, they are defending the indefensible. So a chance to deliver a ball into the box. So he's plotting something before playing it in. Saul, Pepe, and it's Cristiano, Cristiano Ronaldo! And somehow he managed to miss it. And here's Kane. Maguire drives it forward. Defenders on the back foot. And it's Tevez. And he's through the middle. It's Griezmann! It's gone a long way up and away. His full play back and has booked him for the original offence. <laughs> well, it remains.
remains to be seen whether they can come up with that little bit of class to rescue the situation and it needs to be any time now really and they've been caught out here and here's the chance to counter a real chance to break now it's Cristiano Ronaldo oh good interception and the counter is on. Trippier. And that will be the final act. Simply, the big day was their day. A day for them and their fans. A truly proud line in their history. So, on to centre stage come the central characters. The individuals who, as a team, blended into champions. And this is their moment.